What's happening everybody? This is another one that I picked up up at the Akron, Ohio gun show. It is a uh, 3040 crack. Serial number says it was made in 1901. The model 1898. US Springfield Armory. So and I'm not going to shoot it all that much because they are expensive. A box of 20 is 80 bucks. So I found three boxes at uh, the Akron Gun Show and I bought all three boxes. I sent one of my friends a message and Asked him if he had any uh, empty brass, and he said, "He goes well. I have um, a full box." And I said, what do you want for those? And he said, you got any 30 on six brass? And I said, I'll probably get a hundred empty. And he goes, I'll trade you for those empty brass. And I said, sold, no problem. And whatever 30 on six brass I get is coming to you. Cause you know, I don't load it. And if I did, the only thing I'd shoot it out of is the the 1903 Springfields and the Garands, but I've been buying uh, 20 round boxes of PPU off of uh, Sportsman's in Wintersville for you know, 150 grain loaded for the M1 Garand for uh, 26 bucks a box, which isn't too horrible. I think it's a dollar six or dollar thirty around for. for the 30 yachts. So I'm gonna, 30 years on and see how this one does. Helpful if you chamber one. A little more pleasant to shoot than the Mauser. So that's, that's that one, you know, it's the first bolt action rifle that the military ever adopted was the, the 3040 Craig. So it's, it's special in that right that it's, uh, it's the first bolt action that the military ever used. Uh, and this one was, you know, made in 1901. Uh, it's got some dents in the stock. It's got some nicks. Uh, one one crack, but that one doesn't go anywhere. Uh, it's got the arsenal mark. Uh, it's marked for the the proof for test firing. So it's just a, it's a cool piece of history. So I appreciate everybody watching and 
I'm going to set up and shoot something different. Thanks.